a horse brush and a pile of debris. And tire tracks on this embankment near Bluegrass Parkway in Nelson County are remnants of the tractor trailer crash early Monday morning. To see the pictures of the wreck and I'm sure the footage that you all had from the helicopter, it was it was it was very um, dynamic. Exclusive aerial footage from WLKY News Chopper shows the scene after officials say a truck transporting seven horses to Keeneland went across both lanes of traffic, the median, and crashed up the hill. All the horses inside had to be pulled out, including three that died, four others that were injured, and the driver, who was still hospitalized Tuesday after being flown to U of L Health. Authorities say he works for Creech Logistics, a Missouri-based trucking company. We do believe that the, that the driver is still critical, but he is expected to make it. Um, and then we, we found out that three of the four horses that did survive are standing on their own. Assistant Chief for Bardstown Fire Department describes the scene as organized chaos. Kevin Grayson says his crews were focused on the driver as equine support staff dealt with the horses. The surviving thoroughbreds were taken to an animal hospital in Lexington, while officials relayed tragic news to the owners about their deceased horses, valued at $450,000. And it, it received a lot of media attention, a lot of social media attention, would be because of you know the nature of horse lovers, and, and, and rightfully so. You know those those are somebody's pets and babies, and you know business even. More than a dozen agencies near and far worked alongside Bardstown Fire Department at the crash site for roughly 10 hours. There, Lexington, Nicholasville, Jesmond County, Anderson County, you know, all those people have lots of experience in, in large animal rescue, and I think uh, their experience was welcomed on our scene yesterday. Bardstown police are still investigating the cause of the crash. From Nelson County, Alexis Matthews, WOKY News.